High Dignity family will back again on the African Unity platform. My name is King Idris and I'm here to give you guys the new insight on what is going on in the home garden in Africa and the international community. My people, we have a lot to talk about today. We just witnessed the greatest game of football in the world, the greatest ever at the Mundial World Cup, at the Qatar 2022 World Cup. We see the celebration from the Argentina side and we see what the French people have to go through with Mbappe, you know, showing his skills and displaying a unique star of football. That's the reason why the president of France, Emmanuel Macron, was on the feed, you know, to console this brother and tell him you still the greatest of footballer ever that have ever come out of France. You know, my people, the Qatar 2022 World Cup come to an end yesterday in Qatar. My people is a glorious one for Argentina and Argentina have already shown their power and their supremacy in the world of football. They have already stamped themselves high at the level with three trophy coming out of the World Cup in history as they have won for themselves three World Cups. And you know, Messi now for everybody, for the debates that a lot of people have been having in the world between Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi. You know, even they have already included, you know, Mbappe, even the young star at their midst because a game of football is all about your prominent skills, your fast level of accuracy and how you can even just put the ball at the back of the net at the end of the day because that is what football, soccer, at, as everybody in the world know, known it to be, is known for. You have to put the ball at the back of the net. So my people, we see a glorious game in, at the Qatar World Cup and a lot of people was blown away with this performance from Argentina and France. From the beginning of the game, it was a everyone for France to chew, whereby Messi show his skills and you know they give it to France early while they converted the penalty and Messi proved himself to be the GOAT as the only player in the history of the World Cup, the Mundial World Cup at the Qatar World Cup that have scored mostly in every matches of the World Cup. It means Messi have scored in all games of the World Cup and Mbappe showed himself to put himself high as one of the players in history that had a trick in in the world cup final like the hoist of Holland is the only person after hoist of Holland to have a trick at uh, to score at the final and, and have a trick at the final and you know this is what we talked about on Africa in the TV we love to see our brother doing great in the world I'm talking about this because Mbappe supposed to be playing for Cameroon. It's an Africa, my people. So I support this brother and I come out to speak about this today because it's an African brother and Messi that comes from Argentina is human being like me. And you know, I support everything, the glorious thing in the world on my platform is all about the unity, the unification of all human beings and for me to come out here to give you guys the prolific insight or what is going on around the world and in the international community. So, you know, my people, Argentina won the World Cup, the third time, and Messi have already proved himself after the 3-3 draw, and Martinez, the keeper of uh, Argentina, really showed himself where he, 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 he saved um, the, the, the kick from the skipper from Bayern Munich, and the other... Um, France player played the ball out of the hit the post with the ball, played the ball off the pitch. You know, this is the reason why then Argentina capitalized on this and they won. They, their player scored the last goal, the young star that played in just 24 years of A, played his first game for Argentina, scored the last goal. So Argentina won 
one for the day. So we've seen a lot of development coming from the Mundial celebration in Qatar. We've seen the transformation of a lot of players, and a lot of players have stamped themselves, them get their, their game eye to the international level because a lot of players will be signed after this World Cup. I'm just happy to this to, to see this greatness where Messi on the IS go scorer at the World Cup and Mbappe you know, leave a great, you know, skills, you know, a great, he, 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 he show his worth that he really deserved what they paid him and what is earning in PSG. is the glorious future of football in soccer history to watch for. It's just like the new Abedi Pele of, it's just like the new Pele of Brazil to me. So I'm very happy to see the transformation of Mbappe and I'll, I'll use this platform to talk on my platform to talk to the African leaders and African youths and African um, sport personnel like anybody can be anything in the world anybody can make anything happen in the world just keep your mind to it and keep grinding and keep doing what you love to do we see the great outcome of the enormous work Argentina national team put into this particular team Messi, um, the Maria that scored at the final, and Messi, and most of the players from this um, Argentina national team that won this World Cup at the Qatar 2022, they have been playing together for a long time. They've been playing together for a long time. Most of the African countries have their own team too, like this Argentina national team that they play in final. Like, let me use Nigeria as an example. In 2005, Nigeria had this powerful national team youth national national team with uh obuke um uh, mikel obi enormous glorious star that they are on the same level with aguero messi Di maria and everybody that come out of the argentina at the time but the nigerian national team never keep their own team and argentina national team keep their own team and now they want them a walk up this is what we're talking about. The African national team need to do a better job. Most of the team at this World Cup, they try to progress. And we are acknowledge the glorious work of the Moroccan national team. And what they do. And how they push the narrative of the African greatness at the World Cup to the world. But we can never pack out what the Europeans and the South Americans have been doing in football. The high class of Argentina team, the Brazilian team, and all the glorious team that come from the South American side that have already proved themselves like Ecuador, you know, the glorious people. And we can talk of the Portuguese national team. Even Ronaldo did not win the World Cup. Messi won the World Cup. He's good. Ronaldo is more older than Messi. Messi is still a youngster. He's younger to Ronaldo. Ronaldo has been playing football for a long time. So to see Mbappe transform on this level to be one of the greatness in the world is a huge surprise to everyone but it's one of the best in the world nothing nobody can do about it and it's the nearest in the nearest future is the start to look for so this is what we come about to talk about how the argentina national team keep their own player for their own greatness and the african people should emulate and do the same thing it's a good it's a good look for Messi how he transformed and he won himself the World Cup. He packed his family, all his people to this World Cup. He spent enormous money to keep a lot together, support the national team of Argentina and everything. So it's a glorious one for Argentina and it's a good look for France too because France won the last World Cup. Some of these players that was out of the World Cup like Nkolo Kante, uh, Pogba, and you know the people that was down with injuries we can see the changes they could have bring to this france national team because we see dembele and you know and Giroud took out of the final after the second goal by Di maria because the coach don't know what to do and this caused them at the penalty level because one of these player could have been one of the players that will be taking the penalty it's the player they brought in that lost the penalty so this is what we're talking about, how we can come together in the universal world to learn and emulate other people's glory and their greatness in the world, like where, what Messi did to actualize this. So Messi is the real GOAT.
hands down, he won himself a walk up. Mbappe can only meet him on this level if he won himself five or four Ballon d'Or. So we should be looking for what will come in, in future. Mbappe have already established himself as one of the top shooter in the world because he scored his hat-trick just same on the same level at the Holland, you know, James Oyes in 1966. So he make himself, he make enormous record for himself already, uh, Mbappe. So on the platform today, just a quick one to celebrate the glory of the Argentina national team and what they have already established and, you know, capitalized the world with their great soccer, you know, to win the Mundial celebration in Qatar, to win the... So Argentina is the official World Cup winner of the Winter World Cup for the first time in history and they won this for the third time, for the third time, Consecutively in history of football, in history of soccer. So my people, is just a glory, glorious one today. Check my platform. I've already talked about Messi. I have enormous content about Argentina and their national team. You know, I talked about everything around the world, entertainment news. Just talked about it. We bring it out to you guys to talk on YouTube. And you know, for you guys, I do all this just for the glory of Africa, for one love, for one unity, for togetherness. And I thank everyone for the outcome, for the response, for everyone that, you know, like my video, share my video, and comment in the comment section. It's uh, kudos to all of you guys. I really appreciate everyone. So my people will be coming to an end of the segment today. I'll be saying one Africa, one people, one unity, unity over division. Thank you. Thank you, my people.